What's up YouTube? Just wanted to make a really quick video here and just show you um, one of the new cars I just got here. This is uh, the Manti Racing uh, Porsche GT3R which competes in that VLN uh, series. Um, also yeah with the 24 hour of Nürburgring. This is by Mini Champs. Um, I was looking at getting one by Spark, but I saw this and it was probably about 80 or 90 bucks uh, cheaper. So I thought I'd uh, grab this and see what the quality is like. And uh, yeah, I got to say, you know what? I'm pretty impressed. I do love the Spark stuff, but again, sometimes it's hit and miss with quality control. Um, but this thing actually seems to look really, really good. I'm quite impressed with the quality here of the Mini Champs. Um, I think they're going to be releasing too, I saw on their website, they're going to be releasing the 912 uh, from the 24 hours of Nürburgring, the winning car. So I guess I will just wait for that. I was going to order it uh, on eBay um, by Spark. But I think, to be honest, I'm going to just wait uh, for that one. I'm really, really impressed. Let me see here. Let's turn the other side. Show you guys all the different angles here. Looks really, really good. And it's Leitz and uh, Makowicki, which are the drivers on this car. Um, yeah, guys, I definitely say grab it if you're looking to do this or the Spark. I mean, I do have, I do have a few of the Spark. I got the Pink Pig over there. And then I also have the same car number 92, but just the, um, this one here with the original livery that it was uh, released with. Um... But that being said, like there were some imperfections on these ones. Um, this one, you can see, well, you can't see it because I'm not going to take it out and show you, but the rear parts of the windows actually where those, uh, um, those slots are and those ventilation vents there at the back part of the window, that's starting to lift away from the car. On that one down there, uh, one of the windows is starting to peel away. So you, you know, dust and stuff is starting to get in there. And this is what I like about the Mini Champ stuff is that the windows, I guess maybe because this is uh, some kind of a die cast composite, it's not uh, maybe resin. I'm not sure, but the windows seem to be a little bit thicker and better and you don't run into that uh, issue. They're very thin windows on the Spark stuff. And on this, it just feels like uh, like on the old die-cast stuff from auto art and stuff, a thicker sort of plastic. So you know that over time uh, with longevity, the model is probably going to hold up a little bit better, uh, to be honest, uh, in terms of the windows. Like, don't get me wrong. I love Spark. You know, their stuff is awesome. And they make they make everything. They make so many different liveries and vehicles that uh, they're better than anybody else in that regard. But I'm really impressed with this car. And I would say if you're looking to get something and you want to try to find something more on a budget, I would suggest this over the Spark, to be honest. Even on the rear here, there was a, another video with somebody complaining Steve, uh, I forgot what his channel is, but he was talking about the gapping um, at the back uh, wheel well. The gapping here looks pretty perfect, as well as the back, like the detail on it. And I'm using not the best cell phone to, to film this. It looks really good, the gapping on both sides. Sorry, let me just turn this thing. Gapping looks pretty damn good. So, anyways... Just wanted to share this video with you guys. Mini Champs Porsche GT3R by Manti Racing. Looks pretty awesome. Thanks for watching.